people have all sorts of different theories about getting tenderloins out when they're doing the gutless method, getting the heart or whatever. On these bigger animals where the tenderloins are significant, I prefer just to gut them as, as a last step. And then if I'm gonna use the heart, I like to split their chest too, their sternum. This is the base of her sternum here. What you gotta do to do this with a knife, you gotta be really careful. And don't, don't get over this where you're exposing your inner legs. Guys get hurt doing that. What you wanna do is go to one side of the sternum and you'll find these little cartilage spots in the rib. You can see this rib is broken now. And you just have to work your way down to that. And it's kind of in and out. All right, so once I've done that, I've gotten through those ribs, I'll take a knife, go up through a rib, catch it, and open up the chest cavity. And that gives me access in there. You can see the heart and everything else. 